Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of The Hydra Dilemma. I am Alex, um, the person behind FCOG Gaming. And if you haven't watched before, uh, basically this is a co-op style playthrough where we pass the save around, uh, myself and four other gentlemen. And uh, we are currently on episode 43. So I'm going to load and uh, get right into it. So this is our base. And part of it has been deconstructed. So looks like Fish played a little bit of a uh, prank on me. Only a fool would fall for that. Actually, I fell for it before, and I recorded the entire episode like uh, it wasn't a prank. <laughs> so um, I'm probably going to post that as like a bonus vid type thing. And uh, if you are interested in seeing that, um, I'll probably put a link to it over here. Sure, why not? Um, but yeah, so we'll let the uh, construction robots do their job. Uh oh, there we go. And uh, oh, that's kind of like a smiley face. Oh, and we'll actually um, get the smart inserters off of that and all I need to do is make one smart one smart insert and put it there and that should be enough to <clears throat> hopefully here not only have one Maybe. Should be enough to... And of course, I put it down by myself. Uh, let's go... 50 smart answers. Why not? Should be enough to uh, replenish all of them that we have down here. So there's that, and for some reason there's an underground thing that's missing, but we'll go ahead and uh, put some of those in storage and get those built. Do, 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 do. All right, and all that stuff is catching back up, which is awesome. We're just missing one smart inserter, it looks like. Which should be being manufactured here shortly. Maybe. Here, we'll just go ahead and help it the rest of the way along. Alright, so that's all completely reconstructed. So we'll go ahead and start requesting some more smart inserters right there, which will feed our blue factory, which will be great. Okay, so we're back to square one. Um, yeah, it looks like I was... Uh, what? What is going on here? Is this just something fun somebody was doing? Oh, fish. <laughs> Damn it, fish. Damn you. Alright. So, that was a lot easier than uh, taking 20 to 25 minutes to get half of that done. So, looks like... 
for the most part, we have a fairly smoothly running factory. Um, it does look like we are a little bit low on copper ore, which is supposed to be running up this way, so I'm going to go ahead and check on that. Looks like somebody built a railway. Let's see here. Alright, so we've got a copper mine here, which is not keeping up. But, there is a railway, if I can get to it. Um, let's see here. I don't have nearly enough anything um, to build a train. I can build a boxcar. Let's go ahead and uh, get our get some stuff set up here. I don't think I'm going to need... I don't know what I don't need. I like all of these things. Um, let's go let's cancel that out of the queue for right now and let's get some engines. We can do 20 of those for right now. Hopefully there's some engines in the uh, network. That'd be cool. Be super awesome. And looks like there is. Awesome. Okay, so what all are we going to need? I'm going to need a locomotive, a car, and looks like he didn't loop it around, so I'm going to actually wait for some more engine units. Maybe. Get another one of those, get that out of my inventory. And we should be gold, as far as that goes. So, what else do I have? I've got a bunch of miners. And soon to have... A train. Alright, so what do I have for fuel? I have some solid fuel. Might as well throw that in there to make it a little bit mobile. And I don't know if I have solid fuel in my inventory. Let's see here. Why am I not moving? Do I have the entrance on backwards? I bet I do. Yeah, sure do. Or at least I had the one on backwards. Alright, so... There we go. Actually, I think I didn't have that set up correctly. That's okay. And yeah, we can pick up this uh, miner that's not doing anything. Alright, so I should be able to draw, I think, six. It's either five or six for rails. Um, let's go ahead and try out six here. Oh, that's in the wrong spot. So it looks like looks like we're going to be limited to five. That's fine. And I need some chests. So there's a couple different ways I can do this. Um, there's basically using the logistics robot way which I don't think is really a good idea at this point, <clears throat> where basically I put a bunch of provider chests and the robots take them over to the smelting operation. Um, but since we're set up right here next to where our copper mine 
was. Oh, I actually wanted that there. I think. Um, I'm just gonna integrate in with the line that's already there and uh, do it that way. So we'll do five steel chests. Do that, and then we'll uh, have a belt for it to go somewhere. Of course, the power lines right now. Where? We'll replace that. Yeah. So that's a very simple way of doing it, but totally works. So, um, and I don't think that we're going to have that huge of a need of uh, copper to really justify setting up a whole splitter thing. If somebody else wants to down the road, that's, that's fine, but I'm not going to take the time to do it. So, I'll go ahead and ride this train. And we'll take it down here. And I'm going to need a, another train stop, which I actually have one. We'll go ahead and put that down right there. And so we'll add him. And we'll go get, go to him. Okay. We'll go to him. We'll pause the train. So um, there's some biter nests right there. That's not really a good deal. Um, and we'll go actually with iron chests. And we'll see the reason for that here in a second. And more of that. So, uh, basically, if you limit it to four, oops, four, to four stacks, it will fill up one chest and then it stops filling up. And then it goes to the next chest. It's kind of the lazy way of doing. Um, the splitter type thing. I keep picking up copper. I don't want to pick up copper. Actually, I've got a shotgun. I'm gonna just do that. It's oddly satisfying, especially after the day I've had today. Um, yeah, take that trees. Dig it. Yeah. All right. So, got a miner. Let's not make the same mistake that we made before and mine cop or iron and copper. But we're going to go ahead and do that. And that should just pick up the copper. And that's also just going to pick up the copper. And we'll go ahead and have one here. And then we can start mining this properly. So there, 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 and there, and there. And one more line here. We've got two more, so let's go ahead and set them up here and here. Oops, that was one too many down. Um, here and here. And we'll take our belts and we're going to do a big. Do loop. Hmm. 
through here. And a, another run through here. I'm out of belts. And might as well get another splitter while I'm at it. And so we'll have this come up. Meet up with that one, and then split down here to there. So that's something like that. And I don't suppose anybody ran power down here yet. Doesn't look like it. So I'm actually going to. Go to the other stop. Excuse my chair there. Sorry about that. Okay, so go to the other stop. Pause it. Um, get out. What do I want to do for research? Um, uh, military four, not really worth it. Uh, man, everything takes alien science, and I don't like it. Uh, we could do effect transmission, although I don't personally use that, so I don't know. Let's go with robotics three because combat ro or because destroyer capsules are just amazing. Okay, so I need a big pole. Oops. Go as far as we can. Can't see. Dang it. And I know the trick about holding right click, but I apparently forgot to do it both times. There we go. Oops. And I actually don't go up there. That's fine. We'll pick it up and we'll go. Here with it. Why not? So we got those, we got that. <clears throat> we got those making more, those making more. I feel like Oprah, you make some more. You make some more. Well, I think those were already powered, but that's fine. No, it's not fine, Alex. We needed that pool. So everybody's making a war, and everybody's happy. <coughs> Excuse me. So we've got all this ore coming down. Doesn't look like the belt's really getting clogged, which is awesome. Might end up getting backed up a little bit right here. 
and that kind of concerns me. Can I have any fast belts on it? Four. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. That'll be that'll be plenty for right now. So what's gonna happen is as soon as these four get picked up. And I know I'm getting close to my time limit here, but I'm going to show you what I was talking about with this. Actually, let's go ahead and cheat a little bit. Alright, so let's say that chest is full. It doesn't pick up anymore. <clears throat> so all of these are going to get evenly filled. And the thing is, there's five of them. So, uh, four, 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 four. So, it's 20 spots, five chests, four stacks each, makes them filled evenly. Um, if you really wanted to kind of have a buffer, you could go five each, which I think I'm going to do. But yeah, it's not as complicated as the splitter solution that everybody seems to love, but uh, to me it works just the same. So we'll load up this wagon real quick, kind of do a uh, dry run. Well, not really dry run, but uh, a run. Do I have any... actually... I'm gonna need. <laughs> um, let's go ahead and make five turrets really quick. It makes me nervous, but we'll go ahead and uh, do that. Just because those bad guys are right there. What am I doing? Apparently I can't count today. Alright. And finish up rolling that in. And there's one more thing I want to do when we get back to the main base. Because I know People aren't going to think about it. <clears throat> All right, so let's play, and we will go to the first stop. There, and we'll we'll go ahead and pause it just for right now, and I'm going to need two requester chests. There, and there, up there, and there. I don't know if we have solid fuel in the network. Keep a stack of solid fuel, and we'll keep a stack of solid fuel. And we'll go ahead and unpause. <clears throat> so that's going to have a tremendous effect on our copper. Uh, let's go ahead and make, make this pretty. Why not? Uh, do something like that. That way these will have a chance to actually run at some point. We pick that one up. That's fine. Alright, so there's that. We're just gonna run 
all the way up here. And should hopefully help out our copper production. In theory. So look at that. That's already getting a lot full a lot more full than it was before. Sweet. Alright. And we do have solid fuel in the network, so that's cool. Um, now the only question is that train depot in the network, which I doubt it is. Oh, it is. Yeah. Sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Oh, and look at them all. Look at them all go. So cute. Alright, so that'll fill up with fuel. Awesome. So, pretty productive episode. Um, and like I said, I am going to be posting a bonus video, um, which is going to consist of me making a fool of myself, trying to fix a factory that's not broken. So, until uh, next time... Uh, go ahead and like if you liked it, and hit subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And, yeah, uh, as always, thanks for watching, and take care of yourselves out there.